What is going on everybody? Coach Ash is here bringing you another video and today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. So a lot of my content is a lot of gameplay related and a lot of coaching related content. Uh, but today we're going to be doing something a little bit more in that like entertainment factor. So as you can see, the video layout is a little bit different for this one. What we're going to be doing is we're going to be watching montages in this series and giving you kind of my reactions to them. Uh, so if you enjoy this kind of content of, you know, as always hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, but also recommend in the comments some of your favorite montages. It doesn't have to be gears. It can be any game, um, preferably FPS games, just so I kind of get a, you know, the, the vibe of what's going on, but. Um, without further ado, our first montage is going to be a montage edited by our very own UYU Marv. It just came out like a week or two ago. It's for a player named Danny Exceeds. It's Gears 5. Let's go ahead and check this out and uh, see what this montage is all about. Oh, he's using Fit for a King. I already love it. Already love it. I like the editing. Okay. Jump to uh jump from asylum to exhibit pretty quickly. Love Fit for King. Ooh, yeah, a little bit of Oh yeah. I love I loved that effect right there, that little like transition, like he's scoping in, you the circle or the camera circles him and then hits the shot. I loved like the bass amplification. I loved the like audio mute. This is sick. Pretty good shot. I feel like right there he missed the chance to kind of sync up that clip to the music, but like it's almost like a like a beat off. I okay, pause. You guys know what I mean. Nice the transition. I'm disappointed that all these clips are like one shot, one kill clips. Like it's a game mode around a headshot, so of course you're gonna get clips in it. Like it kind of, to me, the fact that all of the clips are related to one shot, one kill lowers the quality of the clips. Not that they're bad shots, not that it's not impressive that he's getting, you know, blind fires and back to back blind fires and stuff like that. It's just the whole game mode is revolving around getting headshots, right? Like that's the only way you get kills in this game mode. Uh, so I would like to see these kind of clips, but in you know, your, your regular TDM, your King of the Hill, your, your other game modes that are like ranked, not a sniper only game mode, but you know, that's, that's just me nitpicking a little bit. They're still good clips, just not the same like weight to them. Nice edit for the music too. Like a tree, he cut the music and it made the transition really well. Cuts from one Fit for a King song to another Fit for a King song breakdown. Ooh, that effect was really sick. Matching the kick drums. Good sync. Sorry, I love this song. Nice cinematics. I don't know what that character was doing in the cinematics. I wonder if it'll tie to this clip. 
No, it didn't. Damn. It would have been it would have been so cool if that JD that we saw running up to the fountain on this map was somebody that he ended up turning around and headshotting in the clip. That would have been so cool. Ooh. Okay, if, if you are fit for a king there or fit for a king fan there, you notice it might be a little bit sharp uh of a cut. I see what he was going for, but he needed to let it extend like another beat or two. I love that effect. And then amplified the gun reloading sound right there at the end. That was dope. That was a really cool montage. Uh, I'm a big fan of Marv edits. I'm a big fan, obviously, of, of Gears. So... Uh, really cool montage. Uh, I love the music. Obviously, big fit for a King fan. I I really liked the uh, cinematics. I think the cinematics were on point the entire edit. Uh, I loved how he didn't go over the top with the effects on the clip. So you could still tell what was happening. You could still tell what happened or what took place in the clip. Um, like I said, I would have loved to see it be more clips that were, you know, regular ranked game modes, not just the special... Uh, one shot, one kill game mode where you everybody has a sniper and you can only get kills with headshots. So um, to me personally, that devalues the clips a little bit. But that being said, there were still some pretty sick blind fires, still some nice no scopes and all that kind of fun stuff uh, throughout those clips. A lot of three pieces, you know, double kills, quads. Um, I don't know if I saw any quints, um, but the editing, you know, it, it worked with the music. Um, the music was right up my alley. I know a lot of you guys might not like it too much, but um, I think Gears and Metal really work together and have that like heavy punch of the game and the heavy punch of the music. Um, so I liked it. Uh, I liked it a lot, actually. If you want to check it out, I'll make sure there's a link down in the description to check it out for yourself. And like I said, guys, if you enjoyed the video, hit the like button, subscribe to the channel, and let me know in the comments what your favorite montage is or maybe a montage that you want to see me react to. Uh, I'm thinking I might go react to the uh, old ghost gaming montage that Kapu Edits did. I don't know if I'm saying your name right. Sorry. Um, so I would love to get your suggestions in the comments. I'll be reading those. Let me know if you guys enjoyed this series. I'll keep doing it. Thank you all for the support and for watching. You guys are awesome. I'll see you all in the next video.